Michael Furlonger here for another uh, video of Spirit of the Prophets. Uh, we're talking about Jeremiah. Last video, uh, last video, we were talking about the the feeling of uh, Ezekiel. How he um he was unsatisfied. He he was he was burdened. He was bitter. Actually, I think it says that he's bitter. But when the Spirit of the Lord was upon him, uh, now on this now we talked about Jeremiah that he was he says I, I'm young and I I can't speak I don't speak too good <laughs> and. Uh, um, so he says, so, so that was his opening into the, the ministry, let's say. And so as it goes on, uh, the people of Israel are now being, uh, exiled into Babylon and, and God is confronting the prophets of the day saying these prophets, they, they speak things in my name, but I, I never said them. And, and so that's, I just want to talk about how that that must make him feel how my how that makes me feel because I've been to churches where, you know the the music's going and people are shouting in tongues and speaking some language and uh, they're they're they say the Lord spoke to me the Lord laid on my heart the Lord did it, and like all these things and so so God is saying this to Jeremiah now I'm not saying that this is you that's going on in your church but I'm saying it. It's definitely gone on in my church. And he says to, to Jeremiah, he says, Let the dreamers dream. But as for you, um, you you preach my word faithfully. You speak my word faithfully. And I think we need to start doing that as um as I believe the spirit of the prophets is is on us this day, not saying that we are prophets, but these this attitude, this of brokenness that I've been sharing through all these different prophets is on us today. Um, so I just want to throw that one out there. Uh, leave a comment below. Tell me what you think. Uh, tell me if you've had that feeling. You've been in a church. Tell me if you're a non-Christian, but you've had this feeling that uh, there has to be something else out there. I'm, I'm not dealing with this COVID, this whatever the situation is. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a good day and God bless. Bye now.